morning guys hope you had a wonderful day a serious success i welcome you to another series of prophetic prayer and declaration what is that thing you are facing what is that thing that is pulling you down just have faith you are going to pull down mountains tonight as you join us in this prophetic prayer with apostle write down your prayer request guide up your faith invite your loved ones and friends to join us this night have faith that god will surely answer your prayers and you're going to be one of the testifiers Please don't forget to subscribe like and comment on all our videos every long-standing issue that has been around your life and your family and has refused to bow to the name of the Lord. I'm declaring some of you in a matter of days, that situation comes to an end. In the name of Jesus, I invoke the blood of the eternal covenant. Every legal access over your life be released from it now. Be released from it now. Be released from it now. Be released from the cost of dishonor. Be released from the scourging tongues of men. Let me say it again. Any man that fights you goes down instantly. Every ministry here, under the sound of my voice, the grace and the wings of the Spirit that will take you to dimensions untold, may that grace rest upon you. I pray for every man and every woman of God here, the errands and the horse that will hold your hands, loyal men indeed, may God give them to you. here who the testimony over your life is Ichabod I declare by the Spirit of God a restoration happens now thou shall not be afraid of the snare of the fowler nor the noisome pestilence nor the destruction that wasted in noonday says a thousand shall fall by your side and ten thousand by your right side it says none shall hurt you but with your eyes shall you behold and see the reward of the wicked i pray for you as a bird is escaped from the snare of the fowler may you escape from every evil may you escape from every trap in the name of jesus christ i speak over your life go from glory to glory you face speak over your prayer life over your word study life whatever has stolen your joy whatever has stolen your fire whatever has stolen your passion whatever has stolen your focus in the name of jesus by fire let it be restored tonight May the gifts of the Holy Ghost operate freely in your life. May you be a wonder first to yourself. And then may you be a wonder to everyone around you. In the name of Jesus. Anyone here being eyed by the spirit of death. To see to it that you will not finish this year well. To see to it that it will not be well with you and your family. Gehazi came and met the woman and said it's all well it's all well with your household I pray for you because the Bible says to say to the righteous it shall be well therefore I speak over you it is well I declare over you all is well in the name of Jesus Christ doors of delay I command you be open in the name of Jesus Delay, be gone. Delay, be gone. Delay, delay in marriage. Delay in jobs. I cause it to its root. 
I release you in the name of Jesus. Every academic bondage, every academic bondage, Kateka Leko Sopa, Repete Lato Sabadi Adaka. In the name of Jesus, be free, be free, be free. Mental blockage, be free from it. Academic bondage, I set you free. This is the best exam you would have ever written in your institutions of learning. I prophesied by the power of the highest. I call this session for you a season of seven-fold restoration. Seven-fold restoration. Seven-fold. Seven-fold. Not one-fold. Not two-fold. I speak it. Where you have been victimized, any student here who has been victimized right now, whether it is project or service year or whatever, I change it in the realm of the spirit. Any one of your loved ones that has no job, I command fearful supernatural job in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus every womb called Barry I don't care whether the womb has been removed or not right now in nine months time you will celebrate miracle children be open every barren womb be open hallelujah every plague of death over your life or your family members make sure you are lifting your hands up. every plague of death by the blood that speaketh better things because I see miscarriages that the devil wants to bring to many families I see miscarriage of children every plague of death I command it to pass over you forever in the name of Jesus He said, because thou hast loved righteousness and hated wickedness, therefore God, even thy God, has anointed you with a type of oil called the oil of gladness that sets you above your fellows. The anointing that brings you above, I call you in the realm of the spirit, rise up in the name of Jesus. Rise up a new level of prosperity. A new level of lifting a new level of wisdom and Jesus grew in wisdom in stature and in favor with God and with men as surely as the Lord God of Israel lives let a cloak of favor hit you where you are favor 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 every terminal disease in this place HIV cancer in the name of Jesus we terminate it once and for all 
be free in the name of Jesus be free in the name of Jesus S S A S we change your genotype in the realm of the spirit in the name of Jesus every demonic oppression that is responsible for where you are and where your family is tonight it is time for the new anointing cut up your loins and be ready every yoke of bondage surely must be broken i command every captivity over your family by the shed blood of jesus christ captivity ends in the name of jesus in the name of jesus i'm standing in the spirit before a gate and the lord is telling me let god's people walk through it and move forward in their life i command you by the spirit and according to the vision of the lord to me move forward go forward no more stagnation in ministry enter your place of anointing enter your place of rest enter it i place you inside it i take you into the mantle of your life the prophetic oil of your life i release it move forward go forward in the name of jesus christ and i speak to you every egyptian you see today you are the one who knows the egyptian so lift your hands with faith in your spirit everything called an egyptian as surely as the lord god of israel lives once and for all bye bye to them forever bye bye to them forever in your family bye bye to them bye bye to them i release signs wonders i release miracles take it take it take it take it from the depth of my heart according to the order of grace we take your miracle take your miracle take your miracle everything your hand touches from today in the name that is above all names i command it to multiply this is what i'm demonstrating to you what i saw in the spirit that god is connecting you to the people who will take you to the next level of your life may the lord take you where your gift will be needed may the lord take you where your gift i command demand upon your oil demand prophetic demand I command every uncompleted family project every uncompleted family project the Lord shows me the number 21 in the realm of the spirit and I pray that between now and the next 21 days I command angels of help I release it to your families receive it receive it help help is coming Zion's help the helper of Zion move across families move across families 
I tell you as surely as the Lord lives between today and the next 21 days you will see fearful testimonies by the hand of God hallelujah lift your hands I impart spiritual gift upon you at the count of seven let fresh fire fall upon everybody every one two three my god do it i see angels four five six there it is come on take it take it take it take it take it outside take it take it take it in the name of jesus take it take it take it fire the prophetic the apostolic the evangelistic teaching mantles pastoral graces leadership entrepreneurship I fire it into your spirit Everywhere you have been deserted so that no man goes through you. I call you an eternal excellency and a joy of many generations. In the name of the Lord Jesus, doors be open. Breakthrough. Breakthrough. Many of you don't know what breakthrough is. You just receive it. Breakthrough. I release it. Breakthrough. I release it. Breakthrough. I release it breakthrough an angel stands in this row take it breakthrough take it take it take it take it right to the back take it take it Say in the name of Jesus. Say it in the name of Jesus. I decree and declare by the authority of the Lord Jesus Christ that any spirit entity finding expression in my mind, in my body, around my life hear the word of the lord i cast you out of my life now lift your voice and pray pray fire is falling pray fire is falling i cast every spirit i cast every devil i cast every spirit by the power of the Holy Ghost. My mind, my body, around my life, around Koinonia, in the name of Jesus, around my family. If you are married, also pray for your family. Pray for your children. I cast every devil. Mata kota shamalata. Shabras katavareke kosha yalamata. Shake it up. 
my mind. There's no place for you in my life. I call against ordinances. ministering to me a mighty deliverance is going to happen now it's starting with ladies any spirit entity that comes in the form of a man and attempts to oppress you in the night right now in the name of Jesus Christ let the fire from heaven fall right now and command I command that spirit to go help them right now any spirit entity using the face of anyone to molest you and close doors inside outside I command deliverance now I command deliverance now let the daughters of Jacob possess their possession in the name of Jesus Christ hallelujah I'm hearing in my spirit uncontrolled anger it's a spirit it's leaving people right now uncontrolled anger is it's an unusual anger rage it comes you can see anything and you can do anything I'm seeing fire in the name of Jesus anyone who is a victim of this operation right now in the name of Jesus I bring you deliverance I bring you deliverance by the power of the Holy Ghost uncontrolled anger I come against it now please help her I'm seeing a vision and the Lord is asking me to pray on that case in this vision I'm seeing someone dream that's what I'm seeing now and in that dream you keep seeing yourself going back either to your old house or to a primary school or writing an exam you are finished it's a strong spirit of delay I stand by this apostolic and prophetic grace help your wife right now in the name of Jesus at the count of three the spirit of delay hear the word of the Lord let God's people go now one two three I command that spirit go now go now please help them go now this one thing I do forgetting the things that are behind no devil should take you back again I command that spirit go now I cost that spirit now if there is anyone you know whether you are here or anyone you know that for some reason has not been able to take in 
in the name of barrenness whether you are here or you are standing for them i want you to agree i want to pray let's see the devil that will stop them from taking it in the name of jesus anyone you know and you are standing for that the devil i don't care what the medical report is that the devil has come to make sure that they will not celebrate children in the name that is above all names we release children from heaven in the name of jesus we release children from heaven we open every barren womb in the name of jesus christ hallelujah the lord is showing me a group of people you see you have dreams frequently and in the dreams you see yourself receiving things and it's something that in the physical you are hoping to receive but the moment you see it in that dream it will never happen again it's an irony it's like the opposite of what you see in dreams is what happens the lord is asking me to deliver those people now please help her help her just stand near your wife so that she doesn't have to fall right now in the name of jesus shakatos emprantas kanasone hashamariakata in the name that is above all names, I decree and declare from the realm of the spirit, let there be deliverance for you now. Let there be deliverance for you now. If you have seen this pattern I'm about to describe in your family, then I want you to listen carefully. It's always that the future is worse than the past. You never have a situation where you leave certain things and go higher and higher. You look at all your loved ones, they once worked, they once married, they once had children, they once had a house. You are in a situation where the future is never brighter than the past. It's always once upon a time this was happening. I need to crush that devil from your life. Please help them. Once upon a time, I was rich. Once upon a time, I was married. Once upon a time, I was on fire for God. Once upon a time, I was a pastor. I had a church. No, the path of the just is as a shining light that shineth ever brighter unto the perfect day. When your tomorrow becomes worse than your yesterday, there is a spirit reversing the equation. Lift your hands, I want to pray for you. In the name that is above all names, I declare that any force from hell that is responsible for aborting a glorious tomorrow to take the events of the past and still bring it into your tomorrow. Right now at the count of three, I declare that spirit must let you go. One, two, three, let them go now. Let them go now by the anointing of the Holy Ghost. In the name of Jesus Christ. My spirit is heavy. Circles of repeated sicknesses. I want to pray now. It's not a normal thing. Whether it is hepatitis, whether it is a blood-related disease, or whether it is every month malaria, every month malaria, every month typhoid, you treat it, it still comes back. Every month headache, every month whatever it is. Hold on, please. The Lord is showing me something. I just saw like a pile of money. 
and then I saw it disappear and the Lord said there are people money physically disappears like lives their life I'm not saying you waste it you can keep 10,000 and come back and find 7,000 and nobody was in that house it's not just money items you can wash clothes and hang it you you didn't steal it you will come back you will not find it listen where well, this is a, a deliverance series just allow me to help that lady I'm seeing a lady in a vision now you were alone you washed your underwear in the night by the next day you didn't find two of them again it's gone from that day something happened in your life in a strange way severe menstrual pain is one of the things you started having uncontrollable pain in the name of jesus everything the devil has taken from anyone i decree and declare by the anointing of the spirit let there be restoration now let there be restoration now let there be restoration now the lord is showing me someone every time you see someone die in the dream a few weeks later it will happen physically now you have seen your loved ones you saw them last week you saw like a, somebody was announcing to you that i don't know if it's your mother or something that died if we don't pray for you it's going to happen in the name of jesus christ i declare oh death where is thy sting all grave where is thy victory i prophesy right now upon your life by the anointing of the holy ghost i command that death to pass over your family i command that death to pass over your family Just, just let me just talk about two issues I'm struggling to share what God is showing me now this has to do with a group of ladies listen there is a lady here every time you see yourself in a dream you are a man not a woman that's why I'm struggling to share what I'm saying. Physically, you are a lady. But every time you see yourself in a dream, it's like you are carrying the form of a man. This thing has affected you even in the area of relationship. If a guy looks at you and says, I love you, it's like, it's like, um, it's, it's like you feel as if you are gay. It's, it's like something has numbed the capacity to receive love as a lady because of that encounter. It's a demonic thing that I have to pray for you for. A very demonic thing. I'm seeing like smoke. This is strange. Shout this loud and clear. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus, I decree and declare that in this year of open doors I prophesy over my life and destiny all doors open open your mouth and begin to pray decree and declare mention every door you know command it to open all doors all doors marital doors financial doors ministerial doors business doors health doors the door of your mind the doors to your influence I decree and declare by the power that raised Christ from the dead please hear me any door standing in front of you that has refused to open i call upon the god of my covenant between now and december 31st please hear me in the name of jesus that grace is coming on someone the grace for open doors take that grace now the grace for apacotes catapata 
the grace for open doors receive that grace right now i speak to every closed door a father be open a father be open we believe you are mightily blessed through this message if you have not given your life to christ please say this prayer lord jesus have mercy on me i know i have sinned against you forgive me all my sins and cleanse me from all unrighteousness and make me your own beloved child from jesus name amen Hi-ya, hi-ya.